everybody. Time to get into it. NBA action on 2K Sports. Brian Anderson here. With me tonight are analysts Richard Jefferson and Grand Hill. And our reporter, Allie LaForce. We've got the visitors facing the home team. Now the starting group for the visitors. With the teardrop. And that's two points on the layup. There's a touch of artistry to the floater. Takes feel as much as skill. Pass to Buckets. Thompson outside. Here's Baller. Just five to shoot. Here's Buckets. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. First personal foul, first team foul. At the line for your home team, Bradley. Taking two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. Both good from the line that time. Here's shake and bake. Let's it go. Misses off the left iron. And about a minute gone in the first quarter. Down low. Oh, and he blocks it off the glass. Wow. Hollis Jefferson outside. Here's Shake and Bake. Gets it to go from eight feet. He just brings a great feel for the game at the offensive end. And we're about a minute and a half into the first quarter. Team foul. Number one. First and the fans foul. love seeing incredible Second moments on defense like that block. I mean, letting them know up front that he's on the hunt tonight and eager to knock away shots. I love it. Here's Baller. Clock at six. The 17 footer. Can't hit it. He's 0 for 2 now. Pass to Baller. Here's Shake and Bake. To the left wing. Deflected. And they get it back. And there's the shot clock violation. Couldn't get the shot off in time. Here's Baller. Pass to Buckets. Fires the three. Missed it. Now 0 for 1 on this game. Doesn't go for him. First quarter of ball, almost two and a half minutes in. And just wasn't Number able to four. set up in time. First personal foul. First team foul. Down to five on the shot clock. Thompson pulls it in. That was a good look for him from mid-range, but just couldn't make the defense pay. Oh, it's stolen away. Baller. And it goes. As the official calls the foul. Count it. And he'll shoot one more at the line. Shooting for the away team. Number 21. One shot. And 
again here in the first, about three minutes in. Failing to find a rhythm offensively. Something that needs to change and change soon. And Coach called his timeout to try and reset things on. Pass to Baller. Here's Buckets from deep three-point range. The putback. Number Boy, he hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance point. Just great positioning to get the rebound and get it back up. And first quarter, we're about three and a half minutes in. Six on the shot clock. Knocks down the long J. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. Yeah, that just comes down to a lack of effort. The defender has to do a better job fighting through the screen. Here's Baller. Now quiet so far offensively, searching for his first points of the game. Back to Thompson. And the ball goes out of bounds. Turned over. Yeah, a communication breakdown. Two guys. Pass to Baller. Here's Hollis Jefferson. No good on his first attempt of the game. And he felt like he needed a little bit more space with the fade to get off his shot, but that might have been what threw him off and made a miss. Now Thompson. Here's Buckets. Three-pointer off the mark. Inside, here's Shake and Bake. Oh, a great one-two punch. Beautiful pass and a nasty jam. Nice one-handed jam. Simple and effective, B.A. Hey, with the lead, I'm surprised he didn't come up with something a little more creative. And there's just one foul now away from the middle. foul. Third team foul. On defense, the visiting team. Pass to Buckets. There's the three. Misses his fourth shot of the night. Still hasn't hit one yet. Here's Shake and Bake. Defended by Thompson. Here's Shake and Bake. Shot clock at five. Off target. That would have pushed the lead to double digits. Here's Baller. Back to Thompson. This one for three. The rebound by Hollis Jefferson. Pass to Shakenbeck. He got a piece of it. Boy, they need something to go to regain some confidence. No question. Way too many empty possessions for them. Here's Buckets. Looking to win the drought. They get it back. Nice work on the boards, paying off for the basket. Oh, he'll wear you down with the way he grinds it out on the offensive glass. Pass to Baller. From 20 feet. And misses it off the right side of the rim. Here's Baller. Looking for his first basket still in this one. Back to Thompson. Gets his second attempt to go. Now he's one for two. And they may have talked about shot selection coming into this. Shoots off the step back. Can't connect. Making him one for six from the field. Pass to Baller. Here's Buckets. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. The first one falls.
And good on the second, so he makes them both. Yeah, they're hoping to turn things around with this timeout. On the wrong side of the scoring run here, we might see a lineup change. I'll, I'll be pretty curious. Here's Baller. And he's going for the oop here. And they're on the break. To the left side wing. Pass to Silk. Here's Perez. Six to shoot. From downtown. Rebounded by Shake and Bake. The baller. Two minutes remaining in the first. Two minutes. To end the drought. That's another miss. One for seven in this contest. Here's G. Oh, it misses. Had a chance to tie it. Here's Hollis Jefferson. A quick shot there. It's off target. Pass to Perez. And he hits it to tie the game. Just outstanding distribution. This is the kind of team chemistry that you love to see. Here's Baller. One ten left to play in the first quarter. Pass to Hollis Jefferson. Good. Getting enough shots in close to play inside out. And the replay of that slashing drive to the hoop, courtesy of Mobile One. Yeah, and in close games like this one, B.A., you need toughness. Guys who will run to the fight and get after it. Here's Perez. 44 seconds left in the first quarter here. That gives him the lead. He's consistent from out there, especially when you give him that kind of room. Pass to Shake and Bake. Jacks up a three. And no good. We've got 22 seconds left in the first. And that one goes in as he's fouled. It'll be three points if he converts the free throw. Hold on. Rondé Jefferson. First personal foul. Fifth team foul. At the line. the shot yes. the bucket is good and he'll go to the line an aggressive move takes it strong and there's no help defensively number five one shot From deep, no good on the buzzer beater. One quarter in the book, and it's been a close one. They lead by one, and we'll be back in just a minute with the start of the second quarter. Good action already in this one, but a fairly even matchup after this first quarter of play. And from what we've seen here from the home team, what's your take so far? 
Well, a big differentiator was their ability to generate offense by pounding the glass. They're just out hustling them on the boards, punishing them for refusing to box them out accordingly. Here's the kid. He's looking Number good. 15. Two buckets and three attempts. From nice ball movement there. Number That's seven. how you break down the defense. Pass to Baller. Here's Maverick. To the inside. Baller. Hey! And the shot counts. He's fouled. And it's a chance for a three-point play. At the line for the away team. Number 21 at the line for one. And that one misses. Pass to Perez. Shot clock at six. Puts up a three. First shot won't go. To the paint. Here's shake and bake. Misses in close. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. Second personal foul for his lead. No good on the free throw. He hits the second from the line. Pass to Baller. Five to shoot. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. Personal foul, second team foul. At the line for the away team. Number 21. At the line for two. And he drops the first. And it's tied up with that one. Second quarter of basketball. Just over a minute and a half played so far. Pass to the kid. Six to shoot. Baseline try. That one rolls around and rims out. Here's Baller. Out to the right wing. From deep three-point range, it's deflected. 4-3. The rebound by Hollis Jefferson. Hollis Jefferson's got five rebounds in the game. Second chance shot. That one a little long. Hollis Jefferson's gone just one for four so far. Here's Big Dog. Well, no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Shot is up. Second chance effort. The kid's shot is off. Out to the wing. Out left to the wing. Here's Baller. He has seven. From outside the arc, it's tipped. And it's going to be a 24-second violation. They turn it over. Substitution on the court. Give me an open. 
And here in the second quarter of action, as we approach four minutes played. Pass to Baller. Throws it up high. And the lob disrupted. Not to be. Hollis Jefferson with the bucket. Hollis Jefferson's got his second basket. And once more this half, they find a way to get great position inside. Here's Thompson. I have to admit, I mean, it's always a tough decision for the ref on the block charge call. Substitution on the court. Here's Baller. Well, he hasn't put up any points yet in this one. Buckets. Oh, no good. Had a chance to take the lead. To the middle. Here's Shake and Bake. He's got it. Three for seven now. A quality pass setting up a quality shot. It's just textbook basketball. Pass to Thompson. Here's G. Defended by Hollis Jefferson. Shoots a fadeaway. Oh, and that one, no question. Powered it down. And their offensive rebounding is such a strength for them when he's on the floor. Yeah, he really helps them extend possessions, doesn't he? Yeah, you can feel Coach smiling on the sidelines with every offensive board. This is the definition of forcing it. He's trying to get himself going, but taking tough shots just won't do it. He can really read the floor. Precision pass in rhythm. Fantastic replay we just saw of the mobile one drive. You're toasting the defense and getting in close. They'll take possessions like that one all day. Here's Silk. Here's Shake and Bake. No good with a fallback jumper. Thompson left side. Out to the right wing. Buckets can't hit. And he continues to cast away. But the results just haven't foul. been there tonight. Third team foul. Substitution on the court. Here's Shaken Big. He has six. To the right side. Pass to Baller. Here's Shaken Big. Clock at six. Inside. Ooh, Thompson with the block. Here's Buckets. Pass to G. Got a hand on it. And they're on the run. And the basket by Mr. Moves. Yes. Great teamwork on that drive. Punctuated by a strong finish. Yeah, that's nice execution. Running with purpose and creating an Now here's Thompson. Here's Silk. Played it in with a nice touch off the window. He's got five. He saw a pass to the rim and he took it. The defense just couldn't stop him. Pass to Baller. Defended by Thompson, and he drops in the layup off the glass. I just love when teams make it work down low. Here's Buckets, beyond the arc. And that doesn't go. He's an ice-cold one for nine from the field. To the inside, Hollis Jefferson. Can't hit from in close. Hollis Jefferson's gone just two of six shooting, 33%. Pass to Thompson. Count that one. Thompson's gotten four this quarter. He really hooked the defender with that pump fake. It worked to perfection. To the wing on the left. 
Hollis Jefferson with it. And that one off the back of the rim and in. Hollis Jefferson's got six points. Nice ball movement there. Delivered the pass right on time. Pass to Buckets. Thompson with it. Six points for him. There's the triple. Gee, no good. Defended by Thompson. Now Hollis Jefferson to the paint. Six on the shot clock. Defended by Thompson. Misses the three. Used the pump fake well, but he couldn't capitalize. Down low. Here's G. And a missed layup. A perfect example of how to protect the rim. This is why he's out there in situations like this. He stands tall to prevent points. Here's Silk. He's got five. Pass to Buckets. Let's go with a three. Drains the triple. Nine points in the game. And that's on the defense, giving him a decent look. That's his shot. There's 45 seconds left in the first half of this one. Here's Shake and Bake. Off the left rim and out. Pass to Buckets. Boom! He jams it straight down. He's just an aggressive finisher there inside. Hey, when you got bounce like that, you feel like you can take on anybody. Here's Shake and Bake. Six points for him. And yep, it's good. Great recognition of the mismatch, abusing the smaller defender. Poor guy. And so a close game as we wrap up the first half of play. Leading by one. And time now for the halftime break with the third quarter soon to follow on 2K Sports. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. And we hope you enjoyed the competitive first half of action. Bernie Johnson here welcoming you back to the 2K Sports Halftime Show. That guy right there is Shaquille O'Neal. And that guy right there is Kenny the Kid Smith. Taking a look at this home squad. Kenny, how'd you see it? The bench scoring has been a big key for them. They came in with energy, and they were able to get them started a real break because of the way they perform. That's the kind of production every team hopes to have on their second team. And Shaq, let's get your input on the visiting team. Their inside attack has been overwhelming. Hard to beat someone when they're looking at the win. These guys are holding their real physical. Thanks for joining us, folks. We're now just a few minutes away from the start of the third quarter. Second half of basketball is upon us, and we may be in for an exciting finish based on how close of a game we've seen so far. Pass to Buckets. Over to the left wing. Just five on the clock. Here's Baller. The rebound by Hollis Jefferson. Hollis Jefferson's got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. Up and in on the layup. Number five. Give him eight. A, a great move. I mean, the defense has no response. Yeah, taking it right to the rim. One imagines that might be discussed at halftime. That's going to be on the film. Outstanding dribble drive. And that replay was brought to you by Mobile One. Yeah, B.A., I mean, that's such a big play here in a close game like this one. Great concentration from him. Pass to Baller. Here's Buckets. And it's flushed down. A nice jam. 
We've seen five lead changes so far. Neither team able to pull away. Yeah, this game just feels like it's going to come down to the wire. And what a drive that was. Replay courtesy of Mobile One. Oh, big time drive and finish. Showing a little artistry on that take. I could watch moves like that all day. Now here's Hollis Jefferson. He has six. No good with a layup. Pass to Buckets. Third quarter of play with just over one and a half minutes gone by. Thompson outside. Here's Baller. Back to Thompson. He tries for three. No good that time. The only time he should take a shot like that, shoot around. I'd like to know what he was thinking. Did he think? Nah, he could not oh, foul. Foul. Off foul. Number 15. Second personal foul. First team foul. And he makes a first. That misses, so he splits the free throws. This team thinks they should be up in front, but at least they tied it up. Pass to Buckets. Here's Baller. And they're going to count that bucket, and they'll send him to the line. It could be a three-point play. In a tight game, they wanted to make sure of that possession. First team foul. At the line for New And the free throw, no good. Sinks the tray. He's got 12. Six lead changes in a game that has a lot of character. Yeah, both sides stepping up and making big plays. To the left side wing. For three. Rebounded by Shaken Bait. Just over two and a half minutes gone by in the second half. Pass to Hollis Jefferson. The jump hook. Shots blocked. They get it back. They recover it. Shake and bake misses. Here's Big Dog. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. To the paint. Here's Baller. He gets it in there. Rate of baskets assisted. It's a stat I really like. It tells the story of how well you are playing team offense. Pass to Baller. A little under three and a half minutes off the clock now in the third quarter. Here's Shake and Bake. The shot, no good. Three-pointer. Hits the trifecta. You give a shooter of his caliber that much time to seam it up? Oh, yeah, you're done. Good idea to call timeout. It looked like the guys were getting some heavy legs out there. Over to the wing. Here's Baller. Seven points in the game. Five on the clock. That three's off the mark. Here's Big Dog. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. The basket drops, and he gets fouled on the shot. One free throw coming his way. You know, that was an excellent play right there. Using his strength to power through contact. Second team foul. At the line. Pass 
to Baller. Driving in. Can they get it? Here's Shake and Bake. And he goes in for the dunk. Grabs the board and goes right in for the putback. I love it, B.A. Yeah, wanted to close the gap. Makes sense to get aggressive on the glass here. Here's Buckets. 16 points for him. Nice work to rise up and secure that miss. Solid rebounding effort from him. Inside. Oh, he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. And he knocks down the first one. Both shots good from the strike. Some big guys struggle at the line. Not him. He's put in the work to defy that assumption. Oh, and he nails it from the high post. He has seven. Good heads up basketball. Sees an opening and capitalizes. Pass to Hollis Jefferson. Launches it. That one doesn't drop. Here's Buckets. Here's Perez. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Here's the kid. Defended by Hollis Jefferson. The kid. It's not going to go for him. Ooh, some solid defense from Hollis Jefferson. And it's blocked. Here's Perez. And he was camped in the lane there. He gets a three-second call. Failing to find a rhythm offensive team. Something that needs to change and change soon. And Coach called his timeout to try and reset things on offense. Pass to Baller. Here's Shake and Bake. And the foul on Rondé Hollis Jefferson. That's foul number two for him. Just a superb read on defense to come up with the block. Oh, amazing indeed. And getting stops like that only encourages him to keep attacking on the offense. Boy, this offense has been dynamic and diversified. Just everyone sharing the ball and sharing the load makes you difficult to defend. Pass to Silk. Oh, there's the alley! Here's Baller. Here's Shake and Bake. And counted from 12 feet. 14 points for him. <laughs> I'll tell you, when he rises up to shoot, and with his height advantage, oh, he knows he's going to get a clean look. Yeah, the defender just lacks the reach to be able to contest him properly. Away team foul. Number 21. Second personal foul. First free throw is good. And that's good as he hits both shots. They've been having major problems offensively. Definitely in a bit of a dry spell. From about 19, that one is off. Pass to G from about 16, and they recover it. Clock at six. Here's Silk. Picked it out of midair. Two minutes remaining in the third. Two minutes. A minute 58 left in the third quarter. Just five on the clock. Pass to Hollis Jefferson. Oh! 
And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. First personal foul, third team foul. First one falls for him. Hits both from the stripe. 144 left in the third. Thompson outside. And there's the lob. And the lead increases on a crazy offensive sequence. And the dunk alone would have been incredible, let alone the fact that it came off a pinpoint pass. Pass to Bowler. Defended by Thompson. Here's Baller. Five to shoot. Tipped. And he stays with it. And there's the shot clock violation. Couldn't get the shot off in time. A minute nine left to play in the third quarter. Pass to Silk. Here's G. The rebound by Hollis Jefferson. Hollis Jefferson's got 10 rebounds here tonight. So active. Here's Shake and Bake. He's got 14. Unloads. That one off the back iron and out. Three-second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Pass to Silk. From behind the arc. Here's Thompson. Deflected. They retain possession. <laughs> no debate there. He got hammer. 44. Fourth personal foul. Fourth team foul. The first free throw is good. That one falls, so he hits both of them. Here's Shake and Bake. Going inside. Gets an open look and hits it. 16 points for him. The third quarter comes to a close. They're up by five. And we'll have the start of the fourth quarter for you as soon as we get back from this short break. And let's take this opportunity to show you our State Farm assist of the game. And <laughs> just a selfless decision from your two guard, showing his ability to get his teammates good looks. We talk a lot about playing for one another. Right there with the pass, he's demonstrated what it means to do exactly this. And I know I speak for all of us when I say I can't wait to see what kind of finish awaits us here in the fourth quarter. <laughs> Defended by Thompson. Just five to shoot. No good with the triple. I think he's gone completely dry. Nothing is hitting. Yeah, and the risk now is that he gets inside his own head. Time to take deep breaths in through the nose, out through the mouth, and let the game come to you. From seven feet, and the shot's good. And he's shooting it at an efficient clip, but he needs to keep looking to score. It's what his team relies on him to do. And no lack of aggression on that move. Good for the 2K drive. Oh, the energy and focus on display. Saw an opportunity to get inside, and they continue to build at this lead. The basket counts, and one. He'll go to the line, a chance at a three-point play. Gotta fight harder to get over those screens. Yeah, as soon as these guys feel contact, they are just disappearing like they're not even there. You gotta show some fire and keep defending. Yeah. 
One minute in now in the fourth quarter. Pass to Buckets. Out to the wing. Here's Baller. Offline with a three. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. About a minute and a half through the fourth quarter now. And the whistle on the shot. Got some contact there. Two shots. That free throw, no good. Good on the second one. Final quarter of play, about a minute and a half off the clock. Pass to Buckets. It's stolen away. Here's Baller. From down in the low post, it goes. Here's Baller. Out left to the wing. Here's Buckets. Drops in the three. 19 points in the game. Making the defense look absolutely helpless. <laughs> He's in full control. Shoots from 14. It doesn't go for him. There has been nothing for him this quarter. Ever since halftime, he's lost all of his touch. Here's Big Dog. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. I like that. I mean, And the first one at the line is good. Good on both. We're in the fourth quarter here. Just under two and a half minutes gone by. To the middle. Intercepted. Here's Buckets. Defended by Hollis Jefferson. Shots good by Buckets. This dude is capable of some memorable moves. He's showing off and having a little fun. Yeah, they're hoping to turn things around with this timeout. On the wrong side of the scoring run here, we might see a lineup change. I'll, I'll be pretty curious. Hey, guys. Over that break, I was able to catch the message that the visiting team coach was giving to his team. Point blank, he wants better shot selection. He told them, we're settling, guys. Come on. We're not being patient out there. We're not working the ball around. That has to change right now. Okay, good stuff. Thank you, Allie. Pass to Shake and Bake. To halt the run. The rebound by Baller. A score here would build the lead to double digits. Yeah, they seem very much in control. Here's Buckets. Six to shoot. Defended by Hollis Jefferson. He hits it just before the shot clock expires. Number four. Over three and a half minutes through the final quarter now. Takes a three. No luck on that one. And as long as he keeps missing from deep, the D will keep letting him fire away. He's just off from range right now. To the inside. And that Number one's good. Four. Shake and bake. Feed the interior. Good things will happen. Pass to Buckets. And he lobs it up. Oh, and that one is stuffed right through. He gives up a bit of size at the center position, but his leaping ability, well, let's just say that makes up for it. Trying to find a spark here. Yes, indeed. A rough stretch offensively. They could really use a basket. Here's Shake and Bake. Looking to end this cold spell. That shot, no good. 
this has not been his best quarter. Yeah, he needs to mix things up on the offense. He simply just can't keep missing shots at this rate. Number because he's destroying his teammates. Second <laughs> And he knocks down the first one. And he makes both free throws. Pass to Baller. Here's Shake and Bake. Shot clock at five. Fades. Oh, and that one had the right spin on it. It's good. That gives him a double-double. Sometimes the pick doesn't even have to be perfect. It can just be a pick. He just needs to create a sliver of space. Inside. Here's Baller. Ooh, nice concentration to hit the double clutch layup. <laughs> That's tough to take as a defender. You've got position, and you still get beat. Pass to Baller. The layup off target. Nice contest. A high level of energy. That's how you play defense. Here's Baller. It's stolen. Here's Baller. Four on the clock. Off the mark. Had a chance there to trim it to single digits. from about 16, and he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. Impersonal foul. And he drops the first. He's perfect from the line this time. The visitors with the ball. It's a 14-point game. Baller. Shot clock at six. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. First personal foul. Fourth team foul. The first one falls. And so he hits both. They put together a solid lead. And it doesn't seem like they're going to back off. Pass to Silk. Here's Buckets. And there's the rejection. Down low. Uneasy, too, on the layup. No settling for an outside shot there. They went right to the hoop. Thompson outside. Pass to Buckets. Down to five on the shot clock. Three-pointer. That shot is off. And he almost made them regret defending him so loosely. Here's Shake and Bake. And 
the deficit down inside single digits. 20 points for him. Yeah, they're hoping to turn things around with this timeout. On the wrong side of a scoring run here, we might see a lineup change. Now I'll, I'll be pretty curious. And now a moment to present the New Balance Player of the Game. And he really made his presence felt on the inside. Just so active and looking all game long for openings. And he found them by scoring a lot of baskets by slashing to the hoop. Hey, these fans love him so much. And when he gets it going, they respond. The crowd's energy fueled his performance. Grant wouldn't be a bad idea here to slow it down. The yes. coach is definitely looking for patience and execution. Here's Buckets. Defended by Hollis Jefferson. It's good. He recognizes players were fatigued and needed time to catch their breath. There's a minute 47 left in the fourth quarter here. From the high post, the rebound by Silk. That's the shot they wanted. It just didn't fall. Tough to watch those miss. I'm sure they'll convert the next chance. Here's shaking bait. The quick look, no good that time. Man, they've been careless with the ball tonight. Yes, yeah, a lack of focus and a lack of discipline. They're better than this. Now here's Thompson. And the baseline jumper, no good. One ten left in the fourth. Here's Buckets, defended by Hollis Jefferson. Back to Thompson. Pass to Silk. The basket's good. <laughs> Off the assist from Thompson. <laughs> they have a relentless mentality. Even with the game in total control. No let up with these guys. They're going for the throat now. Here's shaking bait. Oh, and Number makes it 24. with the kiss. Don't do anything silly. Just ride out the clock. Yes, if they take their time and execute, the game is all theirs. Here's Buckets. Twenty-seven seconds left to play in the fourth. Can't get it to drop. I hate to say it, but I'm pretty sure we can close the book on this one. Yeah, they fought as hard as they could. Just wasn't in the cards tonight. Fires for three. The shot comes out. Thompson outside. And so they get the victory here at home. This one was a fun one to watch. They were clearly in the driver's seat down the stretch. They really were, B.A. They played with great intensity on both ends of the floor. And they didn't allow their mistakes to get the better of them. And that about wraps it up. For the entire 2K Sports crew, this is Brian Anderson saying thanks for watching. So long, everybody.